20 a month. I'm not even going to mess with them. So we got that middle group, and it's hard. It's like, how do we get through to this? Because what we would all agree, and those of you that are watching, listening, what Frank's saying is zero brainer stuff. Yes or no? Yeah, yeah. Right? So how do we get people to really carry through? Where do we take that message? Do we take it to the dealer? Do we take it to the to to executive management, middle management? Do, or do take we it, take it to the source of the uh, – uh, do we take it to the 24-year-old kid? All of the above. Yeah. You have to take it to everybody because right. it's everybody's – Look, there's two different responsibilities that are that are going on at any given time. Let's just use the dealership as an example. Okay, okay. there's two given responsibilities that are going on at any given time. There's the one responsibility to the business, right? Okay, and then there's the other responsibility that each person has to themselves, right? Okay, no matter what, because right. more than likely that person is not going to work at that dealership their entire life, correct? And more than likely that person is not going to own that dealership where they have the biggest stake in the game, correct? But we we all have the biggest stake in the game in ourselves. Right. Okay. So no matter what it is, we all have a responsibility, right? Right. To progress. And we all have a responsibility to succeed. We all have a responsibility, number one, to ourselves. Right. Okay. Okay. To progress into the best version of ourselves as we can possibly be or become a crackhead and, you know, laying in a sewer somewhere. Right. Like, we, we've been talking, if, for whatever reason, the last several shows about personal responsibility. Yes, so. yeah. absolutely. We really it's have. Not, it's not just the dealer's responsibility. Right. The thing is, it's not just the manager's responsibility. Right. The thing is, we're all human, and it's very, very easy for all of us in talking points and in headlines to be able to blame somebody else. Yes. And the, the more smaller victim you make mentality the, yeah the more smaller you make the group of people that you blame the easier it is to do because the less you're going to get called out on the blame well, yes. on doing it to somebody that's right, so that's it's right. very easy to say dealers are stupid and this right. and that right right it's very easy to do that there's only sixteen thousand of them right okay it's very easy to say managers are fucking lazy right. and they don't take care of their salespeople and they don't train and they don't this and that there's probably only i'm i'm guessing a hundred and thirty thousand right. of them right Okay. Right. You know, but you don't have to pick on the salesperson because society does that. Yeah. Right. Name one instance in popular yeah. culture yeah. in the last fifty years where a car salesperson has been put in a positive light. Yeah. Yeah.